Hey everyone, DeckWizard here. I'm going to share with you how to enable FSR 3 and frame generation in the new Silent Hill 2 remake on the Steam Deck and Linux. Open a folder from desktop mode and go to Home. Click the three lines here in the top right. Make sure Show Hidden Files is enabled. We want to do the following. Click dot .steam Steam Scroll down to Steam Apps and Compact Data. Now make sure your view is set to this third one here like mine so we can click Modified twice. And we want to find 212 Double four nine zero. This is the prefix number for Silent Hill 2 Remake. Click inside, PFX, Drive C. We want to click Users. Steam User, App Data, Local. And here, you'll find Silent Hill 2. Saved, Config, Windows. Now in here, you'll see loads of INI files, but the one we want is this one, engine.ini. So double click, and we can expand. We want to scroll to the very bottom, and we want to paste these two lines of code, system settings and Fidelity FX FI enabled equals one. This is an Unreal Engine 5 command which will allow frame generation to be enabled. So once you've done that, press save and exit. Now from desktop or gaming mode, we want to access Silent Hill 2, access the properties, and in our launch options, we want to write Steam Deck equals zero space percent command percent and make sure the S and D in Steam Deck are capitals as this is case sensitive. Once we're in game and on the main menu access the graphic settings and you'll see that from our upscalers FSR 3 is now available and we can choose this and once chosen you'll see that our frame time starts jumping. Choose performance and for our quality settings I'm just going to use low preset. We have FSR 3 and frame generation enabled but I wouldn't say it's the best way to play the game as if you look at our VRAM it's jumping up to 8 gigabytes which isn't ideal and in the top left our FPS is going higher but we're using all the RAM on the Steam Deck and the more we travel around we just get these stutters every now and then. See, went down to 30, 40. When like an enemy is within our proximity. But, you know, if performance improves through patches from blooper, then this might be something to use. But obviously FSR 3 and XESS were disabled for a reason. But it's nice to know that we have this little trick available to us. So, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel, give me a like, and share this video with others. You all have a great day, and I'll see you later.